What's up guys, P-Line Pro, Cody Kelly here. And today we're talking knots, or one knot in particular. Uh, we're gonna talk to you a little bit about the knot that I use when I'm tying the P-Line TCBX uh, ape braid. You know, it's the it's the smooth, the, the, the slick line. Um, really, really good for punching or for anything against wood, against cover. It's, it's a little bit quieter when you're kind of yo-yoing it back through that cover. Um, you know, a lot of people that flip and punch and things like that down in Florida and the Delta and the grasses, they snail them. You know, the straight shank hooks and things like that, um, a lot of people snail those hooks. I absolutely do myself as well. But something I do, anytime I have just a plain hook, you know, with a, a flipping flipping rig or a Texas rig worm out in brush piles or anything, I'm going to go ahead and snail that. Um, and you'll see why in just a second. But I'm going to run through how I do this. Um, several people do it different ways. Um, there are several different ways to do it, but I'll just run through real quick how I do it. Um, to start out, have your you're gonna have your hook down, hook point down. You're gonna come up like this, straight up through the bottom. Go ahead, when you're starting out, you know, go ahead and come with, with plenty of it. And you wanna kinda make a little loop right here. Just a little loop, about the, about the length of a hook. We'll say, we'll say the length of the hook. And then I'm gonna hold it, and see? You got the strands side by side. I'm gonna hold it, and then you just come one, two, three, four, five, and six for good measure. After you bring that up there, try to do this where you still see it. See, you still have this loop right here. You're gonna bring that tag in through that loop grab it hope you can see that grab it right there pull from there start working it down and you can see it start cinching down work it down that bend a little bit tighten it up and I when I'm cutting braid I'll leave quite a bit too you know I leave just in case it slips you know braid can slip a little bit and the reason why everybody i'm sure you've seen it but the reason why i like to snail a hook look how it kicks out like that big texas rig worm flipping punching just anything that bear hook you set the hook that weight hits it it's gonna pop right out pop out catch them in the mouth check it out p-line eight x braid snail knot try it out should help you catch more fish. See you guys.